this week's Student Athlete Spotlight profiles basketball player Q Murray. After stops at George Mason in Appalachian State where she played shooting guard, the redshirt junior was asked by coach Diane Richardson to man the point guard role. Murray has been more than up to the task, leading the team in assists and ranking third in points while assuming the leadership role for a team with eight new faces. I think I've always been like a natural leader. A lot of people always just gravitate towards me leading. I think I have a voice that carries, a, a, a demeanor that carries, I guess. It wasn't really a, a shock to be you know, a floor general or a leader. Um, it's kind of in my nature to lead. I've watched her since she was in middle school and I know she's never been a point guard. She's always been off the ball, but she's also a leader. And I know she has a great basketball IQ. And when she came here, we, we didn't really have a point guard in place. And, you know, I had that conversation with her. And, and, and she said, and, and the nice kid that she's always been is, Coach, I'll do whatever you need me to do. And she's filled that role and done really, really well. Murray also does well in the classroom. At Milford Mill High School, she received honor roll recognition all four years and was in the National Honor Society. During the fall semester, she finished with a 3.74 grade point average and completed her psychology degree. And it's always been instilled in me that academics are first. My, my mother is a physician. She's an OBGYN. She went to medical school. My dad went to school for engineering. He's, uh, he works for John Deere, so education has always been around me. Murray and fellow transfer Ryan Holder, a Roland Park graduate, have also brought Baltimore toughness to a team currently tied for the lead atop the CAA standings. When you're Baltimore made, you're just cut from a different cloth. Me and Ryan, we, you can you could just see it. I don't know really have, know how to explain it, but it's just it's, we're just cut from a different cloth. Baltimore basketball is, is you you can see that it's, it's a little bit tougher. It's a toughness and it's a tremendous sense of pride. And uh, you know, I call her an old school basketball player because you know, back in the day, you didn't get on the court and, unless you won. Won and, and you know, if you didn't win, you'd go home. And, and she has that mentality, the win or go home mentality. Mm -hmm.